Hi guys, we're the Apple Asians. I'm Panda. Behind me is Af. Ooh, really bright there. And today we picked up some fun little items from Ross. You got, you're not gonna point something out. What? No more setups here. Oh, everything's back there. Yeah. Okay. Well. <laughs> yeah, I guess. Clear the area. New scenery. Which one you want to start first? So I am going to, uh, so like I said, we picked up these little mini, um, mini blind things. see. Oh. That's a bottom line. We picked up these mini uh, surprise items, and these are, are particularly cool because they're gross. They're supposed to be gross. And now these are right. have been this for like the longest time. Yes. They're like little uh, mini food things. I just think they're precious because they're so cute. Uh, but yeah, so these are the regular mini food items. You'll see like popular brands. Jack McCrack, Pizza Hut, Cinnabon, uh, Boba. You got some Boba tea. And I think there's like some ramen. There was ramen next to it. Oh, okay. Yeah. Some no, takeaway, take PF Chang. Oh, yeah. There's the ramen. And so, but this other one is the gross version. Mm -hmm. And you get the super rare mold. So, which one is the winner? Uh, so, the idea is that we get one each, mm -hmm. and then who pulls the best is the winner. So, we picked one and then we separated it. When we get home, somebody mixed them up together. So, somebody. <laughs> In my haste to uh, clear away the plastic bags, I didn't realize that I was mixing them up. So, that is definitely on me. That's my bad. So, then we have to settle who's going to win yes. if we pull certain things. Uh, you mean what we win? No, who's going to win if we pull like any items? Well, I think. Which of the items? Um, that one's going to be a winner for sure. Yeah, well, that's it's an ultra, ultra rare. rare. Yeah. yeah, so you'll see so the, the ultra rare is the pizza. Frozen moment. You pull that, you're you're the winner. Mm -hmm. But I think the rest of the items will just have to do, you know, subjective. It'll be definitely subjective. There's no subjective with you. Oh yeah, they're subjective with you. Sorry. Well, I There's don't. No I don't think. I don't think you could compare Jack and the Crack mini pancakes with something like. I think the final result also counts. I said like how good the quality is made. Okay, yeah, yeah. The the actual item. The end result. Of yeah, the, yeah, yeah, yeah. Versus how realistic it is. Mm -hmm. But like, I'll, I'd, t I'd probably take some P.F. Chang's over Jack. Okay, which course. one do you want to start first? Uh, I want to do the regular, and then the we'll regular? do the gross. Okay, yes. then you want to explain these while I'm cutting this one open? So the winner. No winner. You no? just get to do that one. I get to do it? <gasps> okay. This one is a um, make it live. So you get to assemble yeah, the mini item. Say. You unbox it. And then you put it together, like you literally put it together and make the display piece. But it's teeny tiny, teeny tiny. So you're going to be Christ. using some definite tweezers. I don't think they're included. But, um, you know, you get to make try your hand at trying to work with something so minuscule. I feel like those people who build, you know, those boats in a bottle. I feel like those people. I, I, I'm going to get the experience. Like the diorama builder too. Yes. Mm -hmm. if, you're, if you're into dioramas, if you're into like model making, this, this is... Where it's at, and then you, of course you could use these items in any dioramas that you you do make. So, so here's the question though: with that last one, mm -hmm. are you gonna build it live, as in like we're gonna record it, or are you just gonna build it by yourself? I think and we just post a photo. I think we should build one, post a photo, and then do one live because I, I gotta know how how hard what I'm getting into. Yeah, but knowing how you build Legos, hmm. If for anyone who doesn't know, I built. Okay, uh, the I answer helped... is T D E D. Yeah, but you know my experience with that last Lego we did, I had to like rebuild my section. It was very whole. It was not a good one. Okay, so are you taking one? I'm taking one, or both no. these mine? No, both yours. But are you going to open one of them? No, no. Okay. I, got one. I both open. Okay, okay. You're going to sit on the sidelines. There's a chance that this is going to be a very long video because you've never opened these before. Well, clearly they don't rip as easy as I thought. It's like a rip card, like you know when it when you pull down the the middle and it just stops because the plastic is so dried out. Okay, well, to heck with this. Just peel it like an apple. Still so not working. This product is just not environmentally sound. No, I'm sorry, Earth. I know you scream in pain when you see all this plastic. Holy shit! It's two layers of plastic. Oh, they really want to make sure you're yeah, not. Uh... The checker one is also not a layer. Oh my goodness! And is there no perforation? Yeah. Oh, there is perforation. Okay. At least while well, you know, drop the balls. You Put drop it. the balls there. All right. So the first one. Let's see. 
Oh. I think there's like mini packaging. Yeah. <laughs> wow. Oh. Okay. So it looks like you do get multiple. Mm -hmm. You get five. You get five. five. Or four. I can't remember. Get five. So I was like, these are $10. So good. Well, it's a long video, guys. Sorry. And you get to tick as you collect, as you can see. Ooh, got to get them all. He's a lemonade. So, He's a hut. Wow. So from another YouTuber that I watch, um, they managed to rip all of this within a minute and post it in a story, which I don't think is going to happen in our video. <laughs> no. I got to enjoy. I got to ooh and ah. And this is a smoothie juice dope ball from Jamba Juice. Not bad. All right. Mm -hmm. You want to look up what smoothie it is? While I do the rest. Okay, next Number one. two, Zamba Razzmatazz. Ooh, Razzmatazz. Mm -hmm. We used to sell those at my high school. Is it that or, or Zamba Watermelon Breeze? Who knows? It looks the same. Oh, well, yeah, you're colorblind. Is a straw color, maybe? I don't know. Even the straw looks the same to me. Oh, well, I think the Watermelon Breeze is rare because yeah. it's got the diamond yeah. on it. So I don't think it's that one. And no, it probably the has, yellow like, one, or something. The yellow one is the super rare. Oh. Yellow one, super rare. Okay, the next one up, we've got Kura. I've been to Kura. And it's a little sushi. Oh, that's cute. <gasps> oh, that's cute. Isn't it? Mm -hmm. This that this beats the smoothie. This is the smoothie. one that goes to compare. Yeah, this mm -hmm. beats the smoothie oh, yeah, any definitely. day. You can Let even twist see. this. That's super rare. Oh, look at that. Sushi, where are you? Oh, it's not. What? What is it? Just like a, a salmon roll? Which one did you get? Salmon toro? Yeah, that's salmon toro. All right, all right. That I'm liking salmon. that one so far. This one feels like a pizza box. Not bad, not bad. I mean, you could, once you see this, like this is flat, you could totally tell pizza box. Is there so really no. Fat is better? No, you want non flat because then you know it's pizza. That's what I'm saying. Fat is better. Yes. Okay, so. Oh, there's something inside. Detroit. Oh, this is Detroit. Has anybody had the? De I have not had Pizza Hut Detroit style pizza in a Here, while. It's upside down. Is it? No, because this is this is the bottom. I don't know. You can see the logo right there. I know you can see the logo, but okay. You need like fingernails. I got little stubs fingers. Oh, there you go. Awesome. Oh. Yeah, it's not pizza. Oh. What do you call it? Breadsticks. No, no that's breadsticks. pizza. It's Detroit. Detroit. Um. Flat. flat bread. Yeah. Uh, no, Detroit is a deep is a yeah. deep dish. Detroit style pizza is deep dish pizza. Oh. It's almost like Chicago, but not quite. There's oh. more sauce in Chicago style pizza. Nice. I'm a connoisseur of pizza. It's not pizza. centered. Oh, it's not good okay. For OCD people. Okay. Yes. If you're OCD, this will 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 bother you, but delicious nonetheless. Oh, I must say it's a tie between the sushi and the pizza. No, -uh. easily sushi. That's if it's you. just a plate of sushi without the cover, yeah, I'll give it to the pizza. Yeah, the plate is what makes it. Look. All right. Oh, that's a bugger. We've got... What is it? Flavorific. Ooh, the hinge is on this. Did it just break? No, it, but it, it is does feel like it will snap. No, it won't. I know it won't, but it feel it felt tight that I was going to break it. But yeah, there we go. We've got a flavorific. Um, I'm going to say this is just a jumbo jack. And it does not come out of the box. Oh, booty. you can't take it apart. Is it scented though? Turns out they're scented. No. <laughs> that does not smell like burger to me. No. Or That's maybe it's been sitting on a shelf for too long. <laughs> maybe it's been, yeah. Got myself a pretty good meal going on. I'm hitting all the uh, major food groups. So the red delivery bag pizza is the ultra rare. Red delivery? Mm. You know, the, the one the courier used? Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Oh, that would be really cool. That's cool. I'm so happy with Detroit. Yeah. I like deep dish pizza more Zero, than four, four. regular pizza, so I'm a fan. Love that bread on that. I feel like I was going to break that off. So the only way I can tell what kind of burger that is is... Oh, this one had an insert the, in it. But... Looks like you have... <gasps> What'd you get? Noodles. Oh, this looks like noodles. I thought it was the... But it looks like you have to oh, insert nice. it. Oh, nice. So, the, so it yeah. makes it like the chopstick is uh, mid air or something. Yeah. Well, the it says the chopsticks come out, but it came with the chopsticks in there. But they are removable. They are removable. Both are. Yeah, they are removable. <laughs> They're just kind of wonky right now because probably when I was ripping it open, they bent. But you just stick it in here. Here. That's ultra rare. Is it? Because that's the frozen. 
Yeah. You see how it's like quote unquote frozen? Yeah. yeah frozen moment. Nice. Nice. I got one ultra rare. Mm -hmm. And I think this one, I, I, mm, I still I still like the sushi one. I still like the sushi lid. I think it's just ultra rare just because of the frozen. Yeah. But. I don't, I don't think it's much special. Yeah. They're both from Kuru though. Kura. Kura yeah. Yeah, this is stupid. It's a hard time getting a stick in there, but I think it's just because the plastic is so flimsy. But what do you expect when it's so tiny? There you go. Look at that. Yeah, that YouTuber that I was talking about, he does his own. So I just mix and match from different series, and then he used the epoxy resin mm -hmm. to make it freezing time. So cool. That is awesome. All right. Now that I notice that these handholds are here. Maybe I'll have an easier time of uh, not destroying the package while I'm opening them. <gasps> Pizza Hut. And it's just, I think, a cup of water. Was it Sprite? we got to get our branding in there. No? However, the cup is really cool looking. The, these are your regular, like... Yeah, generic cup that they yeah. have over there. But the, they're, they're the OGs. They the are the OGs. Yeah, Pizza Hut red cup. Yeah, with the <gasps> red. But... Hey, you got money. It came with money. Oh, it came with money? Yes. Yeah, that's the uh, part of the accessories. So does it say that is that rare or no it just says accessories. Okay. What kind of currency did you get? Not a freaking clue. A hundred it looks yeah. Russian? Oh, francs. Francs. And it says, yeah, mini brands, but it does have francs. You could see it, definitely. Dollar dollar bills. I don't know how Ooh, much that nice. is. You know it fits. Yeah. That's really good quality on the paper there. Okay, one down. <gasps> Have you been to Cinnabon? Look, you even so. get paper. Like, it's paper. Actual oh, nice. paper. That's a really so good these are like mini details. donut holes, I'm assuming. I, it's been a while since I've been to Cinnabon, but I, I just recall every time I'd see it as a kid, People would buy those ginormous Cinnabons and it would it would take a it's like a burger container, but it would be all Cinnabon and like they would eat the whole thing and I was just like I would beg my mom just to have one of those. We would only get the cookies from TCBY. I mean, who'd let a whole kid eat who would who let a a kid eat their a whole thing of cin we'd be bouncing off the walls. I'm sure she wouldn't have liked that. But yes. Cinnamon sugar are they are is there a rare version of that? I don't know. I'm preparing this one for you. Okay. The packaging claims that it's made from a cert certified recyclable recycled well, material. Yeah, these Plastic. are recyclable, so I really appreciate that. That's nice. And they, they blind it well, I, I mean, aside from feeling it. Mm. Uh, so this is a, just a P.F. Chang's cup. kind of wish I had some other food, but that's all right. Here we go. And then is this another? Yep, Pizza Hut. What? The flat one. What? This is another. Boo. Yeah, this is a dupe. You get two pizzas. I should deduct you a point for getting a dupe. Is this more centered though? How did you open it? There was a sticker that I was referring to. Here. I see the hinge. Oh, there we go. And the pizza is upside down. Oops. So, two pizzas. And then the last, but not least. For this particular series, you still have many more to go. <gasps> okay, is this Jack in the Box? Uh, Jack in the Box. Uh, no, this is P.F. Chang's. Oh, can I open the container? Because that would be really rad. If <gasps> oh, you know, you know what that is? Hot stickers. Mm -hmm. You get a little sauce. You could see the little bits in the sauce too. That That's is really oil. good. Yeah, chili oil. Or no, it's ponzu, I think. Pergiosa? Ponzu. Pergiosa is ponzu, therefore, um, pot sticker is not. Oh, yeah, technically it's ponzu too. Yeah. yeah. So, here we go. And you could see the little dragon on the PF yeah. chain. Oh. I've never been to PF chain, so. Look at that. That's some good <clears throat> detail right there. PF chains and the Kuro for sure are. Besides from P.F. Chang's drink, that one, I feel like they cheaped out right there. Uh, you get one dupe. Yeah, one like dupe. One That's nice. Yeah. No, not too bad. Not too bad. More balls. All right. Got more balls. So, uh, 
So this is the uh, gross set. Ooh, and you get Cinnabon, a sticker. Yeah. Is there any more Cinnabon? What's the ultra rare for the Cinnabon? There's none. Oh. Mm -hmm. There's one for Auntie Aunt's pretzel nuggets, though. Oh, I love me some Auntie Aunt's. Those are what we would get when my mom would be drag us through the mall. All right, you got a barf slime bag so you can properly coat your extra gross minis. Oh, you have to coat it yourself. Yeah, nice. yeah. So there's moldy super rares. You'll see the mold on a McDonald's burger and some um, uh, noodles. And then the stinky rares where they actually glow in the dark and they have a scent. I nice. Believe. Or I'm sorry. So the stinky rares smell, and then there's a separate one that glow in the dark, and those are toxic glow rares. No, I want to glow in the dark. Okay. All right, we'll see how this this would be like really great. We can't see it here. This would be oh, it's a trash bag. Oh, nice. Isn't that cool? Look or at that. Trash bag. Yes, it's a mini trash bag. Um, Bigger gross. We should have bought more, huh? We should have. We'll go back. Um, I think what? only two. Yeah, it's only two. Oh, oh. Four. 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 Um, don't feel it. Don't feel up my mini. Don't molest my mini. All right, you cheater. Um, I think these ones. Uh, they they remind me of what garbage pill kids should be, where it's like a funny riff on the. I want to see how good their puns are. All right, we've got classic footlongs rot dog with real foot flavor. Look at that. No, nah, I want I real want foot Taylor's. flavor. Yeah, I think we could do oh, better. That's super rare. Got some magnet maggots. Is this one super rare? I mean, it's no, got the magnet. Just regular. Okay, regular. Mm -hmm. Chuck Taylor is uh, super rare. Oh, okay. No, it's stinky rare. Sorry, super rare are the cup noodle, cold throat noodles, and McNuggets. Okay. McNuggets, I think. Can't see. Oh, what is this? Uh, a moldy coin. Yeah. That's it. Yeah. It's that's pretty booty. hefty. Yeah, but it's booty. You can't say that's a good item here. No, but I'm saying it's just hefty. Mm -hmm. Is that their logo or something? Mm -hmm. And then, oh, this is a magnifying glass. I'm yeah. assuming this is an accessory for... for. That's the one that I felt up. I know, but is it meant to do... like? Is there a puzzle that I'm supposed to solve? Because that would be really cool. Or is this just used to, to see how good your item, how gross your item is? Maybe. It doesn't we'll find say. out. Because I, I love puzzles where you look at the puzzle and then they give you a magnifying glass and the clue is in the puzzle. Oh, man. It gets my Nancy Drew drives going. All right. Nerd. Last one. This is not a Snickers, but a picker. Oh, goodness. Pick Do nose. not pick and eat. Hmm. He'll do hmm. it for you. Right? <laughs> oh, all right. And it's got the nutritional facts on the side. You're not you when you're hungry. That's what we needed. I needed the good pun right there. Non nutritious information. Snot, half chewed nuts, mucus, and um, chocolate. Yeah, good ingredients right there. And it's quite rubbery. The mucus is quite rubber. It's got that, you know, um, like one of those sticky hands. That's what it feels like. Mm -hmm. Good proper, proper use right there. So I'm not too pleased just because you only get four pieces and it's already gotten taken up with the coin and the, and the magnifier glass. So I think you're going to beat me on that one. I don't know. Two more. Did this, was this in the, it's like the a book. yeah. So the first one I had the sticker, and this one's Dead Bull Energy Drink, which is pretty cool. I like, I really do like a, a Red Bull. Um, all right, no snot. Oh no, I did get snot. You do get snot in each of your packages. Good to know. All right. It's barf slime, not snot. Oh, I'm sorry, barf slime. We have Sick Talk, and this looks like somebody's iPhone. Covered in mucus. I, I, I don't. I have to admit that one was the least favorite one when I was looking at the list. It's your least favorite one. Yeah. Oh, interesting. I like the food ones. And this one. Let's see. We've got Papa Vomitos pizza. Oh, look at that. There's a little pizza, little pizza, real vomit in every slice. 
Oh, I get it. There's a little piece of real vomit in each slice. I love the puns. I love them. The original and the worst. And you see there, the, the he's on the bo- they even put it on the bottom of the, the lid and then it's Does got... Does it go in the dark? I don't, I don't know. It doesn't come out. The ice... No, I don't think so. No, it's I the, don't see any green. It's the supposed to go in the dark. Uh, but it does have the non-nutritious facts, peas, carrots, saliva, eyeball juice, maggot puke, and pineapples. Oh, that's where you lost me. It's the pineapples. Uh, there is a vomito vomit rating as well. Looky there. Some people like to have pineapple, pineapple in their food, too. Those people are dead. No, just kidding. <laughs> the next thing we know, we'll be back up to our channel and have like a few, few subscribers left. I, because you said no, that. I'm not, I, I, it, I'm not a pizza purist if you like pineapple on there go ahead I, I i like as much fixings as possible on my pizza so who am i what to say and next one we have star barf coffee and then we've got a uh the quality looks decent yeah Pretty. barf flies sputum and saliva vom is at the heart of every cup we chuck up let's see start the day with fresh urge to puke you have short chunk Big barf, a grande gag, a venti vomit, and a tall chunder. Oh, I love it. I don't know if this one's my favorite. Uh, I think so, just because of how close it is. But I think the picker, the picker one has got the funnier puns overall. And the last one is another magnifying glass. So the magnifying glass is Something a given. Yeah. yeah. I, it, and I think it has to... Maybe it's to help you to put the barf slide. You think so? I think maybe there's something hidden in the stickers, maybe. Mm -hmm. Guess we'll go find out later. We are, because I'm I'm gonna Nancy Drew this. Maybe there's something on the sticker. All right, do it off screen. Come on. All right, I got one more though. Mm -hmm. Okay, so this one is. Oh, this is a candle making one. Oh, oh, they give you tweezers at least. Let me see the instructions. Lemon tree candles. Do they actually smell like lemon? Oh, so you get the kit to make lemon tree candles? Yes. Interesting. Well, what is no? Oh. On the back it says something else. Garden rose candles. Oh, you get two kits perhaps? No, mm -hmm. this is just like the whole possibilities of what you can get. Okay, read me first. Okay, I'll read you first. But I think it's lemon tree candles because it's. There are a lot of things in here. It just says plants. Hmm? Oh, plants and candles and aquarium. So you do all three? I don't know. There's this thing. Just unbox it for them to see there. Okay. Well, it's nice that there's a little separator. Well, I know which one you got. Lemon tree candles. Mm -hmm. I'm crazy. You're crazy. And so, Sunshine Candle Co. Mm -hmm. But the display looks like. Oh, that's the plate. So, yeah, these are the little votive candles. I like that they put stuffing in there, too, as if these plastic things are going to break. Oh, this part of it. And then we have. Looks they can't like. See it. Lavender beeswax. And then I think this is where you set them on. Yeah, like this. Little little tweezers. They're not, you know, they're just little plastic tweezers. And then in this guy we have. Nah, I want to get an aquarium. Oh, there is a wick. Okay. Mm -hmm. And actual scent. Okay. Looks easy enough. I'm not gonna do that now though. No, it is too long already. Yeah. You'll have to see what it ends up looking like later. Put that all back. <laughs> what a mess. Look at all look at all the mini things on the table. You say mess, I say perfectly disorganized, functional. Um, pile. Yeah.
Oh, I know a little one who would love to do this with me. All right. Too many layers of plastic. Yeah, you know, it kind of defeats the purpose of having the um, environmentally yeah. friendly, like, yeah. covers here, and then the plastic is, like, double layered. So also, this, this was the only one that we can find at the store. Yeah, this mini-verse, I would love to find all the other ones, but maybe they restock this it at another time. Sun grown. This looks like a plant. plant. Yeah. Yeah. And they get, oh, look, they even package it up. Look at the little succulents. Sun grown plant. And then all oh, the tweezer fell out. Oh, is it the cat pot? Yeah, cat pot. Is cat. it a cat pot or like a yeah, cat pot? Oh, or the wooden, wooden pot. I think it's the wooden one, although the cat one would be way cooler. Potter's mix. It's little rocks. Okay, those are little. Where's the pots? I can't see it here. Here's the the rocks. The potting mix. A little trowel. Oh, that's precious. The little succulents. And then, yeah, just, I think it's just the regular. <laughs> no, kitty cat. Can't get a good one, huh? I'm so happy with it because it speaks to my gardening heart, even though I can't for the life of me seem to keep my succulents alive. My real life ones. But these ones will last at least. So, out of the three, which is favorite? This uh, is the price here, just so you know. Uh, out of the three blind box items, I think the first one, the food, mm -hmm. uh, just because you get five, and I got an ultra rare. Even though I got an ultra rare, I got still got a dupe. And then this one, I'm kind of disappointed that I only got, you know, three because the rest was like a. a uh -uh. Oh, you mean like per ball? Yeah. Okay. Per uh, you get four bags, but one of them is automatically a magnifying glass, mm -hmm. and then. I only like like one or two of like I like these two out of the three technical items that I got. So okay, that's fair. Yeah. I mean maybe you get better items and maybe yours will be more enjoyable. Yeah. Uh we look at the price online. It ranges between seven to ten dollars for each bowl, but we got ours from Ross. It's a pack of two. Um the food mini brands, which is the first one that she opened, was at ten ninety nine. The gross one was at nine ninety nine and the mini verse I believe was at fourteen ninety nine or fifteen ninety nine. So good deal. The, the this one here the kit is the priciest and you get one in each bowl so yeah um that'll be the first part of the video just because um she's been taking too long it's at uh, almost 30 minutes mark thank you guys for watching i will upload the second part for my um unboxing i'll see you guys next time good night bye oh, these are cool